Hello. Good morning, all of you. Shalom. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Namo budaya, salam kebajikan. Wa wa wa. The honorable Miss Murnia Dwi is a hard mother of high school bakery woman. While a respectable old mother teacher of high school bakery woman. And then while I honorable all my friends whom I love. I honorable member of the jury in a competition. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for chance that's given to me. My name is Jelmina Nagen. I'm representative from class 11 Science 1. Please, of all, let us say our praise and grateful to our God, to, to His grace and the blessings upon us so that on this good time and action we can be gathered in this place in good heart. Ladies and gentlemen, today I want to speak about Indonesian Youth Pledge. 94 years ago, the Indonesian Youth Pledge declares for one motherland, one nation, and one language. If we look back to the hard time of the soccer in fighting for the independence of this country, Indonesian Jungman had so many enthusiasts to fight for Indonesia independent. They did not hesitate to do anything in their power for their country. And we as their legacy must continue their fight because the fight did not stop when the independence was already in our hands. There are so many things to do for our country for its crowd and to be prosperous. So what can we do? Ladies and gentlemen, if we look at the reality in now townships, if young men have him watched their lives because of illicit drugs in our country, they will mostly fix themselves cruel and fight amongst a broken home family of ignorance of curiosity or particularly of the illegal drugs and mafia. It is estimated that around a million people in Indonesia are illicit drug users. A study by the International Labor Organization or ILO Office in Indonesia showed that the around 4% illicit drug users in the country are children under 70 years old, chairman of the nation narcotic coordinating. Both say that the country's illicit drug users, including around 10,000 senior high school students, over 7,000 junior high school students, and about 800 elementary school students. Drug users among students are particularly worrying. Okay, how about our JVA relationship? Are there too many illicit drug users? We know that illicit drugs don't just affect your physical body and heart. They can affect your mental health, your finance, your relationships, your social life, and your criminal record. So let's say no alleged drugs. Ladies and gentlemen, you is a figure that always bring alteration. We should be the able to become the real generation and proof of we should be the able to be the agents of their reformer for our environment due to the time full of the example, uh, sorry, time full of efficient, let us act in a positive direction. We make ourselves in, in top, an example of the example of this, that is able to transmit the vision to our friends. So for the last, I want to invite to all of Indonesia to get that to put the better Indonesia for the future. Let we show the world to Indonesia to this better and better again, be a prop and a dream hike. So our leader faces of mine on how to continue the legacy of the Indonesian youth who had briefly declared and declared for one motherland, one nation and one language. 
thank you. That's all my speech. I do hope that my speech will be useful in our life. And this is war and the here after. Thank you so much. See you. You have to briefly declare and a declare for one mother lands, one nation and one language. Thank you that uh, all my speech. I do hope that my speech uh, will be useful in our life in this war and here after. Thank you so much.